Brian. Um, what we want to talk about is, did you see what Bob Beckel and Bob Dole and uh, Jimmy Carter said last night on Twitter? Okay, they said that the, we need to get out the republic, the liberal Republican vote to win back the White House, win back the Senate. That's what we need to do right now. And did you know that uh, that Bill Riley still called Obama a patriot? And you know what Charles Krenhammer said? We said right now we need to stand behind. America needs to stand behind Israel and to actually wipe out Hamas, liberate them. And to get rid of these terrorist cells that are that are that that, uh, that uh, a Gaza has uh, hold hostage women and children as human shields. These are terrorists, to, and Israel needs to do anything it can to wipe out uh, these terrorist cells of the face of the earth, obliterate them, annihilate them completely, and this is and and this uh, throw and this throw these and throw the mosque and Al Qaeda. ISIS, throw them back in the Stone Age. Go ahead, Ron Hallwell. Well, you know, when I sit down and listen to Bob Beckel, when I listen to uh, uh, Carter, and who was the other one? Uh, 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 B Bob Dole? Uh, well, you know, three clowns that probably couldn't figure out which way is up. Less long, which way is next? Right, and don't forget one. And don't forget also one Williams uh, is also uh, upset with Israel right now too, as you know. And Juan Williams upset with Israel, as you know. He's upset with Israel. You know that he's upset that that Israel is doing it, it, it's killing these, um, you know, it, it, all these uh, innocent women and children. Well, guess what? These women and children uh, are, are are strapped with bombs. What else are you going to do? What else are you going to do, Ron? Well, the hell with, with Juan Williams. Tell Juan Williams to take his butt over there and stop the war, and tell Hamas. To put, you know, bombing, uh, putting bombs into, uh, into Israel. Right. How come he doesn't do that? Right. And also, you know, they're going to have James Carville on tonight. Again, Bill O'Reilly's going to have James Carville on tonight as a guest. What What the hell's going on over there? I want to know. Go ahead, Ron. I don't have any idea. James Carville is the biggest traitor I have ever seen in my life. Yeah. I, I can't believe that they actually want to use this man as some kind of... Uh, I, I don't know why they give him any time. Right. I don't know why either. It doesn't make any sense whatsoever. This guy, you know, uh, this guy's a... He's a... He's a... He's a Blivering buffoon. He's a he is a pinhead. You know, he, he, Bill O'Reilly made a book called Pinheads and Patriots. I read it, and believe me, James Carville is a pinhead. Why do we keep having pinheads on uh, as as uh, as wasting airtime? I don't know. Go ahead, Ron. Go ahead, Ron. Well, uh, if you sit at home and look at the the history. Of the Democratic Party. Right. This is par for the course. Hold on a second. Okay, go ahead.